Is Lazarus awake? Not sure. Go for the strawberry. <laughs> Maybe he fell asleep in his workshop again. I've been to another world. Well, welcome back to the land of the living, buddy. <laughs> we thought maybe you'd fall asleep in the basement again. Not this time. What crazy sci-fi dreams was it this time? What do you think, Austin? What's he been fantasizing over? Hmm. It's hard to say what he's conjuring up. So what have you achieved before breakfast? I've seen things you people wouldn't believe. Like a, a realm occupied with gigantic robots. I've watched plants morph into vehicles and attack wizards. All those moments merged into one long day. I think that's what they call dreaming, Laz. A reality will kill us if we're late. I invented a multi-dimensional machine to travel to alternative worlds. Uh-huh. Look, it's dangerous. Just don't use it. Not until you've fully read and understood the manual. This is insane. It's just a toaster. <sighs> the slicer gives us the chance to visit undiscovered worlds where dinosaurs are not confined to zoos and where, where Happy Days is still being aired alongside Knight Rider. <sighs> Look, it's not calibrated yet. Don't you realise what could happen to the very fabric of space and time? Let's... Shh. What's that? Okay. I'm going upstairs. Put my tie on. It's not calibrated properly. <laughs> Visit a world where aliens eat at Wimpy's and Gremlins 3 was made. <laughs> you can get carried away. Yeah, well, Orson Welles was right. And I have to get ready so we can go to the lab and do some real science. <laughs> oh, Auntie M, there's no place like home. Where's Gwen? Did she leave without us, Lat? Yes, she has. Unbelievable. She ate her strawberry gentles and she left without us. Great. Stop, Austin. She's used a dimension toaster. What? She could be anywhere and at any time. Serious? I thought you were joking. Gwen might not have gone far. We thought you were nuts. No, seriously, who makes a, a parallel universe machine out of a toaster? The Slicer. My father designed something similar before he disappeared. It's based on his design. Whoa. Do you know what that means? Same thing that happened to Gwen, happened to your dad. is to find Gwen. Can we get her back? There could still be a chance. Well, and snap to it, lads. If you have to reset some dials, push down some levers, you know, pop in some coordinates, then go! What are the odds? 
an endless supply of universes, each with their own version of Gwen? No! With the possibility of advanced time delays. No! On the contrary, there could just be a pitiful number of worlds, each with blatantly obvious differences, thus helping us to identify a real beloved friend. Okay. Yeah, that makes perfect sense. Yeah. You'll need one of these. It will keep you in sync with the machine, me, and our world and time zone. How does it work? Never mind that now. Wait, you got this off the back of the Plastic Man comic, didn't you? No. Well, what's the delay? Start recalibrating it already. Okay. Burn me a pop top. Blatantly obvious differences, thus helping us identify our real beloved friend. Okay. Wait, wait, what just happened? It's on a 10 minute loop. We have a window of 10 minutes in each dimension we visit. Well, we can't just fix it and bring Gwen back. Gwen? Hey, how are you? You okay? Yeah, just making some toast. Alright. We better get going. We don't want to be late for work. Work? We haven't been to work since the aliens landed. Too many loop. As long as we're wearing these, we'll be okay. Gwen? Gwen! I don't think she's in this world, Les. And we should probably stay inside, because the toxic waste outside is going to kill us. You guys are quiet today. Oh my god! Oh, do you grab that boat? You grab that boat? Do we have a you? You took me to a little bit. Oh my god! We need to uncover a new geographical location. I reckon she'll be at that place she likes. Breakfast at Tiffany's. Yeah. Amazing, they actually have a Buck Rogers strip in this one. Austin, go and talk to patients. Ask if she's seen Gwendolyn.
You'll get yourself killed. What did Patience say? Well, she said that Flash issue 84 is the best one. But I told her that issue 187, where he outruns death, is blatantly the best one. Austin, I meant what did she say about a girl? Oh, well, she said that we should try to avoid getting in contact with, uh, Gwendolyn. Hey, handsome. Fancy taking me to Pandora's box later tonight? Hey, passion fruit, give me some of that pumpkin pie. <laughs> Oh, steak! Right! Ah! He doesn't like pumpkin pie, bitch! The McSandwich Corporation is thriving in this new market. Be sure to buy your happy sandwich when you watch Birmingham Pop Tart or He Doesn't Like Pumpkin Pie Bitch. ये दिवस भी बनाई गई है बहुत ही खतरनाक और जानलेवा साबित हो चुकी है। हमें क्या चाहिए? Can we ever get her back? Will we ever see her again? Fear not. I have a backup plan. There may be someone else who can help us.
You're still not ready. Father? Recover the girl. Return to your world. Activated on me in the same way it happened to your friend. Although I was fortunate enough to have set my timepiece before it occurred. But what stops you from coming back? I was delayed because I fell into a medieval realm. It caused a major feud between King Arthur and Sir Lancelot. What kind of an excuse is that? Lazarus, enough! I'll return when the time is right. I still have to visit the Lady in the Lake, pick up Excalibur, and then see Merlin about a round table. You wield a powerful sword. Use it with caution. Thanks for your help, Father. consider bringing back an alternative. No! Gwen needs us. Our Gwen. We can't just stop. It's our duty. Maybe I just know when to quit. We have to accept people for who they are. That includes their imperfections. The theme park is now temporarily closed. It is now in your best interest to stay where you are, revolutionary. I'd rather stay and wait for a friend. I've made my decision to play God, but if you roll the dice again. Gwen? How did you know I'd be in here? 
Oh, well, just a hunch. We thought if you were having a hard day, this is where you'd go. Seriously gone wrong. What did you just do? Where's Gwen? I don't know. Maybe her watch wasn't calibrated to the machine. The machine maybe overloaded. You have got to be kidding me. Run. Well, now would be a good time to get this working. How? I can't. 